Good morning, guys. Uh, Paul K here, Saturday mornings outdoors, and we have a fun uh, video for you guys today. We're going to be discussing uh, the ultimate in home protection uh, shotguns, and these are some way to see. Uh, if you like, like the like button and subscribe, please. It helps a lot with the channel. Please do that. Hit that like button and subscribe. Thank you. So. Uh, this week we're going to be discussing home defense and protection around the home and for hundreds of years uh, home protection consisted of pretty much this and this is I still use this today it's pretty formidable 12 gauge side by side double trigger you can let them have both barrels believe me it's a formidable weapon and originally this wasn't a home defense shotgun this was uh, just a double barrel shotgun that I picked up at a reasonable price, pretty good quality. It's a break open and uh, it was my grouse gun and hunting grouse in New England consists of swinging around a lot because they're really, they take off really wild. So I shortened the barrels here to a legal 18 and a half inches and I had a gunsmith, our local gunsmith put the crown back on and the bead back on. And I have a really nice uh, grouse gun for New England grouse hunting or anywhere grouse hunting and uh, also for hundreds of years like I say they call these coach guns uh, farmers hit them behind the house doors you know the front door and it was great protection you know I mean you had the uh, uh, benefit of both barrels at once and just seeing the thing would strike fear into anyone that's uh, as long as you're home and uh, they see that I don't, I don't think they're gonna go too much further than that so these have ruled the roost pretty much for another word for the another name for these they call them were uh, mare's legs they even shorten them a lot lot, lot more but this is this is a uh, great home defense weapon 12 gauge buckshot or if you want to go all out slugs but I don't think you need the slugs so this is 2023. Now we've evolved into this. Check that bad boy out. So they're called bullpup shotguns. And they're in an AR-15 configuration. They have uppers and lowers. And uh, let's get into it. I'll show you the specs and give you a close-up look of this thing. And these things are formidable. All right, look at that bad boy. If I was a robber coming up on a house and I saw the owner coming out with that, I just, no, not today on this house. And this is pretty formidable. Uh, the name of this configuration, it's called a bullpup shotgun. And what, what defines what a bullpup shotgun is, is the receiver is behind the trigger assembly. So, which gives the designer of the shotgun the ability to make the weapon shorter. So, this is very maneuverable in tight situations. Great grouse gun. <laughs> Imagine showing up this in the grouse woods or duck hunting. Or <laughs> I know there's guys out there, probably down south, that are going to do it. And I, I'd try it. I'd give it a whirl. I'm going to take it down to the gun range and do a video on that. And, and <laughs> watch it uh, but it's for home defense small maneuverable they're uh, they're good solidly built these are manufactured they're starting to come up in the United States they are pretty much most of them come from Turkey now this is from G force arms I I don't know if that stands for ghost force or it's G force arms and it's a Turkish company seems really well built I gave it the full over checkout and uh, it's AR style. It has an upper and a lower, and it's got a pivot pin, and it breaks down just like an AR does. It's really, really accessible for maintenance and quick things you want to get up inside there and work on. So these are some of the parts to it. Uh, this is a muzzle brake. This is removable right here. The barrel itself is 18 and a half inches long, totally compliant, and the uh, muzzle brake, from what I've seen on, on reviews, works really well. I mean, as much as you can slow down a shotgun, you know, especially if you're going to be using uh, magnum loads in this for home defense. So, 
muzzle brake. Then you got your Picatinny rails, full length on top and on the bottom there for mounting anything you want. You got M locks on the side. Personally, I think the first thing would be a, a front grip to control. A lot of guys like it, a lot of guys don't. Some of these come with a configuration when they buy them brand new uh, with them already installed, you know, a front grip of some sort. And uh, pretty cool. So these are uh, flip up sights and pretty good quality. I mean, they came with the gun and uh, really, really good quality, adjustable for windage and elevation. Uh, pretty cool. And uh, I, my first thought when I was first looking at these is, why would you want sights on a shotgun? It's point and shoot, you know. Uh, but uh, for tactical reasons, I think that they may be useful and something that I'm not knowledgeable about. But there they are anyway. They come with the gun. And then moving on down, that you have the charging handle, of course. Trigger. And I've yet to put test pounds on the trigger. You have your selective group, fire and safe, of course, and uh, no, it's not full auto. And uh, hand grip, which I believe is removable if you don't like this particular style, but that feels really good. It's a rubber grip and fits right in and uh, pretty nice. Uh, you got your pivot pins for takedown, AR style, and uh, your ejection port, magazine, magazine well. And this is ambidextrous. I'll get on the other side, but there's another button on the other side to a magazine release, you know, so you can get it from both sides, which is pretty cool. And uh, you have a pretty good recoil pad on the end here. It's rubber and uh, seems to be a pretty good quality. So overall on this side, that's pretty much the lowdown of what it comes with. Uh, also, uh, the American, the patriotic version of this paint job I thought was pretty cool though I am extremely old school and I don't think the American flag should be on anything but this is all they have with that was available and to be honest with you they have a really loud red white and blue one I didn't like that at all this is what I had to settle for that was at the um, place where I bought it at the time and I, I it's kind of growing on me I don't like the American flag I'm way old school on anything hats shirts it's just to be flown that's all that's meant to be. It's a it's a living thing. Anyway, that's today's pol political comment. But let's get on with the review. It comes with two mags, five fives and ones, compliant, you know. But they make other mags. I don't know why you'd want one, but they have ten round mags, and they have I think thirty three round fun clips. But if you can't get it done with five with a shotgun. I mean, what's the point? You know, you're going to get it done. You don't need more than the five. The other stuff's for fun, I guess. You know, ten rounds and the intimidation factor. Believe it or not, it comes with a choke kit and a choke removal tool. Once again, I don't get that. I don't think many guys are going to take this duck hunting, you know, or turkey hunting. Although, it, you know, now that I think of it, because it's maneuverable, it might be good for turkey. But you just look like... You're on an assault mission, you know. It's for home defense. That's pretty much the and how it. And even it comes with a spanner wrench too, for uh, pulling apart the uh, gas chamber inside and all that, the pistons and all. So, uh, uh, so two clips, choke clip, and the wrench. And uh, the whole package is listed at. Six ninety nine. I picked it up for five seventy five. But believe it or not, this very gun. In different paint jobs, I've seen online for 375. That makes me heart sick. This is brand new. Maybe that was used or something, but I feel like I got ripped off. I hate that, you know. <laughs> but it is what it is, and uh, I've seen them online for 375. GF or G Force Arms, they're called. I think it stands for Ghost Force. So Force. So let's get on the other side and take a look. So. The other side, uh, same deal. You can see from the other side. What you can't see is the ambidextrous here, the uh, magazine release, which is uh, you can hit it from both sides. This is very, very slick. And uh, the takedown pins that they have here. And uh, that's pretty much what's extra on this side. But a very formidable weapon. Ex the cool factor, 1 out of 10, is probably a 15. And 
it's just I couldn't resist it. Uh, my double barrel shotgun has served me so well over the years, and uh, it's been around for hundreds of years for a reason. But this here, how can you resist it? I mean, it's got everything. It's reasonably priced for what you're getting, and the wow factor is off the charts. So for home defense, you can't beat this. I'll post a video showing the uh, range, how, how it operates in the range, how it actually operates and, and you know runs, and uh, give you a review on that. But uh, these are starting to hit all the gun shows and all the gun shops. You'll see these in the bullpup configurations and. Uh, extremely useful and cool looking and uh, they found out a new way to sell uh, home defense so, you know it's very appealing and uh, if this fits your bill you might want to look them up uh, reasonably priced like I say from 375 on up so that's this review on the ghost force 12 gauge bullpup shotgun for home defense hope you like this like and subscribe and we'll see you next time see what else we can dig up trail boss let you know